Hello everyone and welcome to another episode of Who is a Science Library Technology? In this video, I want you to stop. Stop saying that you studied SLT. Yes. Stop saying that you studied SLT. I think the people that qualify to say they studied SLT are those that did SLT at MD level. But once you've specialized, you are no longer supposed to say that you studied SLT. In this video, I'm going to explain to you why it is important that science laboratory technology graduates or students specify their specialization when describing their field of study. Let's get down to it. As a science laboratory technolo technology student, as an SLT student or a graduate, you are part of a diverse and rapidly evolving field that encompasses a wide range of specializations. These specializations are in different options. I don't want to keep mentioning many different options. I mentioned them in from my previous videos, but there are very many, many, many specializations, many areas from medical to agriculture to petrochemical to microbiology, among others. Now, each of these specializations has their own unique set of skills, techniques, and technologies that are used to carry out specific types of laboratory analysis and research. However, what I've seen is that many students or graduates in the field of science laboratory technology describe their field of study as simply, I studied science laboratory technology in, you know, start talking about the specialization. This is really, really, really problematic for a number of reasons. Number one, saying that you studied science library technology without stating your area of specialization fails to accurately convey the depth of your field and the many different specialization that it encompasses. Secondly, it makes it difficult for others to understand exactly what you do and your area of expertise. Thirdly, it also makes the Science Lab Technology course look small or like an unprofessional course. To avoid these issues, it is important for SLT graduates and students to specify their specialization when describing their field of study. This can be done by adding your specialization in front of the phrase laboratory technology. For example, I studied microbiology under the Department of Science that very technology. So if I am asked, so if I am asked, I will say I am a microbial laboratory technologist or I studied microbiology laboratory technology. Depending on what you study, you can see you study environmental laboratory technology or you study petrochemical laboratory technology or you study agricultural laboratory technology. When you are asked that kind of question, you should specify your specialization. By specializing your specialization, by stating your area of specialization, you are more accurately conveying the specific skills and knowledge that you have acquired through your training and education in the university or polytechnic. This can be really important, especially when it comes to job interviews, networking, conferences, and other professional opportunities. When you state your area of specialization, Potential employees, colleagues, and others will have a better understanding of your special skills and your area of expertise and know how you can contribute to the organization or their research projects. In addition, stating your putting your area of specialization in front of laboratory technology can also help you build a professional identity within your field. It can make you become an authority within that field. By identifying with a specific specialization, you can become part of a community or yes, part of a community or a lab of like-minded individuals who share the same interests and goals. This way, you can be connected to more opportunities, support, mentorship, and various various types of advancement. I will conclude with this. Next time, when you want to talk about your field of study, always add your area of specialization in front of the phase laboratory technology. Next time, say 
you study biological library technology or microbiology library technology or chemical library technology i hope this video which is well and you understand thank you very much you're also welcome bye